Get your paw off my throat. Hey guys, I am on my way to work. I'm actually already 10 minutes late, but I, uh, the craziest thing happened to me this morning. I got the hiccups out of nowhere, and then I hiccuped so many times that it made me nauseous and I couldn't eat my breakfast. So, hopefully that will go away and I can eat my breakfast. I brought it with me. It's on the chair next to me, but here we go. Off to work. Zach came home super late last night. Like, I was out cold. I don't even remember him coming home. So, he's, he just barely woke up in there because he's exhausted. Um, and then he's going to be late coming home tonight, too, because it is game night for Idiot Box Games, his channel. Um, so him and Justin are going to be gaming at Justin's house. So, home alone again. I came home to let Tracer go to the potty, and she is currently tackling the cat, and he is so done with her. All right, leave him alone. Come on. Come on. Good girl. Let's leave the cat alone. I started reading Harry Potter yesterday in my illustrated book, and I got to like chapter 16 or something. I got pretty far because I had a really slow day yesterday and because I was real into it. Um, and there are so many just like little bits and pieces that I totally forgot. Also, if you guys haven't seen a very Potter musical, you need to go look it up. It's on YouTube. It's not super great quality because it looks like somebody is filming like from the audience. You can kind of hear the noise from the audience, but oh my gosh, it's worth it. It's hilarious. And it has Darren Chris. If you guys have seen Glee or I think he's in The Flash, I'm pretty sure he got his start by being in this star kid production of a very potter musical anyway you need to look it up it's dang hilarious but um i thought of that because there's a tiny little detail in the book that they had in this musical and i was dying i thought it was so funny but my dog just went sprinting downstairs so i need to go make sure my cat is okay i came in here to go to the bathroom and look there's her skeleton which, by the way, has no arms anymore, but look! She has totally dismembered him! Oh my gosh! I don't think there's a toy out there that she would not demolish. And I tried to get her a toy that was a little bit harder to chew up, and she doesn't like it. She only likes the toys that she can completely destroy. So I just had this thought. Um, every time I leave my house, I say to Tracer, bye bye Tracer, mommy loves you. And now, like, that's like the only time I say that. So now she probably thinks that if I say mommy loves you, that it's a bad thing. That that means that I'm leaving. <laughs> Shoot! I should probably fix that, huh? Just got done at the gym and now I have to rush home because somebody from the Relief Society in my ward is supposed to be at my house in 15 minutes because they're spotlighting me in like the Relief Society newsletter or something and I know to some of you you're like I don't even know what that means but I need to be home is all that really matters and then Zach is actually on his way home right now so freaking finally I get to spend some time with him. Goodness. And I left Tracer outside, which I have done occasionally, um, but she gets nervous when she's outside alone. So we'll see how she did when we get home. She did pretty good. She was very excited to see me, but I think she was okay. She didn't tear up the door. Well, any more than it already was. And now she's just running around and playing. I think she's doing okay. I made it in time. I have two minutes before she's supposed to be here, so hopefully she doesn't care that I'm sweaty and gross. And I'm done talking with her. It was great. I have this problem where I could probably talk forever, so she was probably like, oh my gosh, hurry up. I want to go home. <laughs> um, but she was super nice. Anyway, Zach is home. If you can hear the shooting and the stuff in the background, he's playing a video game downstairs. So I thought I should make him the chili dogs that he wanted the other day because I'm nice. So 
So let's get some chili. Chili. Hot dogs. Grace Helbig YouTube channel. <laughs> As soon as I got everything on the stove and cooking, I immediately had to pee. What do I do? Do I just leave it? I'm gonna turn it all on low, and I'm gonna brave it. Here we go. They're still cooking, nothing's burned, and the house is not on fire. Bathroom break was a win. This is my plate. I know, super healthy looking. This is Zach's plate. <laughs> I have the hiccups. Guys, look. Ha ha! Zach is here! We finally get to hang out! I know. We ate dinner. Mm -hmm. Now he's gonna eat some ice cream mm -hmm. and I'm gonna eat some candy. Yep. And we're gonna watch This Is Us. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Tracer. Can I kiss him now, Tracer? What? Thank you. That tastes like dog tongue? No, ew. Well, she was all up on my mustache. Gross. She was! So better bite me! I'll bite you. I'll do it. You don't think I will, but I will. Ow! <laughs> She's like, hey. All right, Tracer, look at me. Look at me. Hi. Oh, thank you. <laughs> oh, thanks. She's such a good girl. Yeah. Any of you out there who are like, I don't know if I want a dog. They're great. <laughs> Just do it. Well, I mean, being in a proper position, like financially and, and time-wise well, to well, have yes. one. But if you can, they're better than kids. Oh, you don't know we haven't had kids. I imagine. Because I remember, like, I was a pretty crappy kid, and I would much rather hang out with Tracer than Kid Zach. Well, we'll just have to have a kid and find out. Okay, we'll do it. We'll have kids. You've convinced me. <laughs> Up until this point, I was not on board, but now I am. Okay, cool. That argument sold me. Awesome. Guys, Zach was playing fetch with Tracer, and she caught it. And she keeps catching it. All right, ready, Tracer? We didn't even have to teach her. Okay, wait, 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 wait. Okay, ready? Ready, Tracer? Yeah! Ready? Here we go. Oh, oh so close. She tried. Ready? Here we go. Oh. <laughs> ah! <laughs> <laughs> I did. Good job. Oh, right there. Don't get spoiled right there. Hi. Hey, look at me. Get your paw off my throat. What do you think you're doing? Oh. Hairstylist people out there will know this. That hair slivers are a thing. They are exactly what they sound like. Slivers, but with hair instead of wood and I was just in the shower and I had one in my stomach a hair sliver somehow a little tiny hair went down my gloves and got stuck in my stomach and was there until just now Zach and I just spent the night hanging out watching this is us um, and now he's actually in bed already and I was just in the shower and now I'm ready for bed, so I'm gonna go to sleep. But if you like the video, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. And I will see you next time. Bye.